fabulous this thing. <laughs> Oh, not the nail styling. Oh, not the nail styling. I mean, the feet. I mean, yeah, it is something. <laughs> Darling, trust me, the first thing guys are watching out is absolutely the nails on the beach. Like, you can wash your hands, you can, you know, but over there, the feet. It is also a thing, so <laughs> my feet need to be polished. Like, oh my god. Come on, let's go. Let's. <laughs> but y'all need some more acrylic dog because I can tell the looks I got sweetie at the beach. <laughs> when I always first get a compliment, it's like, oh my gosh. And then they look to my basic as toenails, but just like a normal <laughs> transparent gel lock. Oh my god, no! So ladies, <laughs> no! So ladies, here we go. First one is fuck, extra is fuck, with sour skin, whatever, here we go. So I'm pushing back my dry, dry, hard cuticles using my cuticle pusher. And afterwards, I'm going to use my fine grit sanding band to remove any shine off my natural plate because this is very sandy, this is very Barcelona beach, uh, this is very not so cute. <laughs> I'm sitting so not comfortable by the way, very uncomfortable. I have plastic, you know, and that is choking and all my veins are popping like a soldier, Hulk or something like that. <laughs> Babe, so if you get your mandrel set, like Melody Sissy for instance, you always get like a little package with some bits in it. Don't throw them away. Uh, you need them for your toes, like for instance, for now. Don't listen to the ladies like throw them away. Like no, you need to go to nail school, like nail education class. Don't throw them away. Here's one of them we need. Uh, this is by the way a safety bit. With this bit you can remove your cuticle area, glue, and this is perfect for the side balls. Like some of my side balls, for my toenails at least, like the big toe, are getting dark in color. So now there was some extra dead skin under, and that is what you can remove with the other end of your cuticle pusher, by the way. It will hurt a little bit because you're, yeah, removing dead skin. Uh, so take your time, and to get it extra dead, dead skin away, like take your time, my gosh. And this bit will help remove more of the dead skin, just make it look more fresh. This is just perfect on top of your toenails without damaging the nail. <laughs> like this little bit, like this ceramic comb bit is just perfect. Now using my ceramic comb bit from right to left, I'm going to remove my side of uh, my natural plate. And when I'm going to do this, I'm not applying too much pressure. But actually I should have because it, I think I can use the speed 6 or 7 for my toenails instead of a 4 to begin with. Thank god I had my little cuticle cutter with me. I removed that extra cuticle area. Like. I washed my toes by the way in between to see where I could see more of my dead skin uh, that would be white of course but it is time for the next time for next week
But boo, I even went to the Mercadona to get some toe separators for you guys. I could have saved some money with that boo, oh my gosh. I could have used some paper towel, look ghetto as fuck anyway. <laughs> but hey, to look, <laughs> but to make my feet look less embarrassing, we got some beautiful green toe separators. <laughs> We're gonna do this so beautiful. I'm just going through my left foot first, applying this acrylic on my natural nail plate and not extend it yet. They are my nails anyway, so I can see what is going on with my nails and just let it dry. And then just click with one little nail form, just one. I can just extend it into a square tapered look if I like it. Let's see how it goes. If I like the natural look or I want the tapered square look. It is also something beautiful. My gosh, I cannot breathe with my plastic in front of me, you know what I mean? <laughs> my veins are popping like hot, you know, like oh my gosh. <laughs> so here have a little b-roll guys, enjoy it, so natural, so gorgeous. <laughs> okay, let's do my other feet, like me. <laughs> Honey, I'm here on stuck on the couch. You guys are watching, so that's a difference, okay? <laughs> so I wish I had some cuticle oil, so it would be softer and quicker. But hey, with what you have, you will use darling, and that's that. Again, we're going to push the driest, beachy, sunny toners, cuticle oils right back, clean it up, and right away apply some beautiful acrylic, gorgeous angelic white acrylic. <laughs> And on this right feet I just used a speed 7 so I could go faster and quicker and it didn't hurt even as much like not at all so thank god thank god I have strong toenails but if you use it on a client just tell them beforehand just get your extra toes done like um, if it's just for an acrylic toe overlay sweetie get your pedicure somewhere else because no cash out sweetie absolutely oh my gosh I did not use any alcohol or primer, but I stayed on for 8 weeks and when I tried to pull them off because I saw some videos from other ladies telling and doing nails without a form, I forgot her name. Such a smoothing voice, T-E-H beauty. And she said something in a video like, okay, when you pop your toenail, it will just pop up. Well, I tried to pull it off and a piece of my toenail came off as well, boo. So how do you mean it pops off? Who, what, where, when, you wish? Like, no, it's the same shit like your fingernail, speedy. You need to soak it off or, yeah, yeah. Just don't pull it off after eight weeks still. No, you will rip your whole nail off. <laughs> or the natural plate as well, you know what I mean? Like, you don't want that. So as I was doing this, I could see like where my natural toenails were growing. So for the next time, I just know like, okay, how to do it more faster. 
a proper place to sit <laughs> where I'm not squeezing myself together. And I think with just one bead of acrylic with a size 10 brush, you're good with that. And we just with one nail form, so that is perfect. Less. An hour, or at least for my feet, like it is quick, quick, quick. You can do them at the same time. You just need to practice, that's the thing.
Okay, I'm so sorry. <laughs> Again, I was just so excited how much easier and how much fun this is. Then my long eyes stood out on me, I was like, I was so excited. So I'm using like an 80 grit file just to smooth the top part and the sides. I was checking if this was my desired look, but hell no. I want to have it tapered.
we're going all in, you know, with that extra nail form. I want to have it tapered, uh, stiletto for my nails, and stiletto for my toes, just joking. <laughs> Square for my toes, and let's do that. So I already filed my nails, so it was just with one small bead, a little extension, and voila, that's it. I just had to extend it. And with my other feet, I just did quick the beads of my toenails. Let that dry because I have to extend my other foot. Uh, but for the next time, it will be so much more quickly done. I think in an hour or less, you're done with this. And I absolutely just wanted to make sure that the acrylic was not touching my skin, otherwise it have some lifting. Not too close to the cuticle area. Clean it up good. And then you're good to go for eight weeks, so that is amazing. The acrylic dried quick and now with a fine sanding band, I'm going from left to right and gently close to my cuticle area to clean that extra product, um, to smooth it out. And I just wanted to make sure that acrylic was not touching my skin, otherwise my skin would be lifting, you know?
So the plain white look was here, just for one night <laughs> or a couple of hours before my break. Yeah, I'm happy with it, like beautiful white. Anyway, I was really excited with the end result for the first time. Like, oh my gosh, this was easy. I went in with a buffing block, put some speed on it and yes, enjoying my beautiful feet just like that. <laughs> I washed my feet, prepared, changed my outfit, did my nails beautiful with a buffing block. Imagine how this can be growing in future guys, like oh my god. Yay! Starting from your room and then one day, my gosh, my gosh. <laughs> so many things at the same time let me take a little <laughs> oh. we're almost there we're almost there take <laughs> care Okay, so this is the second look. This is also an idea, like halfway, just like some stones. Yeah, I love this. I love this as well. So this is second look number two.
And the third one, oh my gosh, darling, we are going in. We're going in. I will be silent for a while, if you don't mind. I can finally breathe. I just want to enjoy the, I know, again, the Swarovski placement. And <laughs> let's call in. Let me tell you this, a full in Swarovski means, darling, for hot weather, sandals, LA weather, Miami weather, Barcelona weather, summer weather, not for sneaker squatting shit, <laughs> not for sneak, not for sneaker squat behavior, because honey, <laughs> how that hurts, you have to put like, yeah, get away, <laughs> you have to put like, <laughs> toilet paper between the toenails, if you want to go work out, so don't do it. <laughs> this is perfect for the beach, you know? Mm -hmm. So thank you guys so much for watching. <sighs> Babes, I'm back on YouTube, doing something different, teaching you guys how to do nails, drying. How amazing is that? Not only baking, but we're gonna bake soon. Hit that notification bell upstairs. <laughs> Comment down below what you want to see next. And I have some videos already planned what's coming up, fruit nails, whatever you name it. <sighs> Babes, mm, love you. Mwah. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys really love my feet and <laughs> I will see you guys next time for sure with a beautiful video doing my hair, doing my nails. Thank you guys for watching. <laughs>